In this module, we, were, we will be discussing non-proprietary methods for processing the EEG. After a brief review from a previous module, we will be discussing spectral edge frequency, compressed spectral array, approximate and cross-approximate entropy, permutation entropy, and transfer entropy. You will recall from module two that when we take the Fourier transform of a signal, we move from the time domain shown in the upper panel to the frequency domain shown on the lower panel. So the horizontal axis changes from time to frequency. The spikes in the frequency domain indicate frequencies that are present in high amplitude in our original signal. The size of each spike is relative to the amplitude of that frequency present in our original waveform. 